Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be reading a book called One Snowy Night. Elvide 8 Second Wonder Why. One Snowy Night by, by M. Christina Bolton. Pictures by Tina McNaughton. The, the cold wind woke little hedgehog from his deep winter sleep. It blew his blanket of leaves high into the east. He shivered in the snow. He tried to sleep again, but he was much too cold. Suddenly, something fell from the sky. Thud! It landed right in front of him. It was a present, and it had his name on it. Little Hedgehog opened the present as fast as he could. Was a inside it was a red woolly hat. He put it, put it on at once. Pulled it to the back. He pulled it to the front. Pulled it to one side. Then he pulled it to the other. But it didn't matter how much how, how matter he stretched out to fit his prickles. His prickles got in the way every time. By now, the hat was much too big for a little hedgehog. He took it off and shared it till he had um, often stared at it until he ha until at last he had an idea. He gave up the hat, shake, and wrapped up again. He ripped a piece he ripped a piece off the label wrote on the house then he ran the rabbit's house the rabbit was out so he left the present on his doors it was snowing hard as a little it was it was snowing hard as a little hedgehog tried to find his way back home the snowflakes flew all around he wasn't sure which way to go. Oh dear, he said. As he wandered to and fro. I sure have came, come out in this weather. But I know Rabbit will be happy to have a nice woolly hat to wear. Too much snow, said Rabbit, rushing home. He saw a present lying on his doorstep. Who's, what's this? He said. With the donut ripping off his paper, a woolly hat, he cried. For me, he put it on <laughs> at once. He tried it with his ears inside. And then outside, he pulled it this way, and he pulled it that way. It didn't matter how he stretched it to fit. His ears got in the way every time. By now... The hat was much bigger, much too big for a rabbit thing. Rabbit wrapped up the hat once again, and wrote on a label, then he went to visit Badger. The end.